slime video. So this isn't just any ordinary slime video. We are going to be making slime kits. Slime kits are just adorable. They have all these little ingredients inside. So today we're going to be making a slime kit to give to your friends for Christmas. I'm so excited. So we went to Michael's and we picked out glue, miniature, glitter, model magic, all of these things that are really miniature that we're going to be fitting into these little slime kits. So we're going to be making three, crunchy, butter, and fluffy. And I will tell you guys everywhere where we got this stuff. I'm going to show you what you need for each kit and then I'm going to show you how to assemble it so you can do this at home for your friends. This is everything that I'm going to be using for the crunchy slime kit. So I've got some beads, containers to put the beads in, a little candy cane just because it's really cute to add little candies, some bags I'm going to be putting note into, some squishies as extras because slime packages always have little extras, some glitter to add into your slime, slime container that I ordered off of Amazon so they have something to put their slime into when they're done, glue, a little baggie for borax which I'm going to teach you how to make so that's a cool DIY, a popsicle stick to mix and then your actual slime kit and lastly borax. For the butter slime kit you're going to be needing a box which we got at Michael's, some little baggies, a candy cane. And then these little paint things, which you've probably got in a kit before. We're gonna break them apart and use them as little food coloring holders. So I'm gonna use green food coloring. I got this one off of Amazon. Then if it's butter slime, you're gonna need some Model Magic or Daiso clay, some little squishies, some glitter, a slime container to put your slime in afterwards, and then a mini thing of lotion. This lotion we got at Kroger in the travel section. Some little baggies of borax, glue, a popsicle stick, and borax. For the fluffy slime kit, it's pretty much the same except you switch out the Model Magic with some shaving cream. And for all of the slime kits, you're gonna need some packing supplies. So I have a little stick on both and this stuff. So I'm gonna be making the crunchy slime kit first. So if you wanna know how to make it, keep watching. So this little hack is to make little borax baggies because every single slime kit or package that I've ever gotten has little bags about this big with little borax in it. We couldn't find like the little bags you could just buy at the store so we have these snack bags here and all you do is heat up a knife and then slice it like that and it seals it. So we have a butter knife. My mom is going to be doing this for me because I'm not good with fire, which if y'all do this, please have a parent do it. So basically you heat up a butter knife with a little lighter and then we have a little plastic bag right here and you just go right across it and it's supposed to cut it and seal it so it's gonna be like really small. Oh wow, it's like turning black. Let's see, is it gonna work, is it gonna work? Okay, <gasps> it worked, it worked, is it sealed? Oh my gosh. We made another one and it's like the perfect size. And it's so like old. Now we have our little bags. They were so easy to do even though I didn't actually do them. But look. Okay, now I'm gonna be putting the borax with a spoon into my little bag so I can get started with my kit. Oh wow, that was really smooth. I thought it was gonna get all like over everywhere. This looks so awesome. Now I have my little baggies of borax. I'm obsessed with them. I think they look amazing. So the second thing that I'm going to be doing is I'm going to put two colors of beads. I decided to do blue and white. I got this white one from Michaels and the blue from Amazon. And I'm going to put them into these little containers that I got from Michaels just because they fit a lot of beads and they're really cute and Christmas colored. So I'm going to put my beads inside of these. I'm going to attempt to pour the beads. Oh my gosh. This kind of reminds me of a candy cane. So I just made these on Pink Monkey, which is a free website on your computer. You can literally just type in Pink Monkey. I use that for my thumbnails and it's free. So it says how to make crunchy slime, how to make butter slime, and how to make fluffy slime. They're like little cards. We printed it down on cardstock, so it feels like a business card. And we don't have color printers, so the candy canes are black and white. So I'm going to cut all of these out. Instead of just using scissors, I'm gonna be using this tool because it helps It helps with like having perfectly straight lines. The little blade right here, you just go right across. Oh, I love that sound. There we go. <laughs> so these are my three little cards. This is all the extra paper right here of like everything that fell. I think they look amazing. They look like real business cards. Now yeah, I'm gonna start assembling my box. So the first thing is to put some of this red packing stuff at the bottom so everything doesn't rustle around and just so it looks like a real present. So let's get that in and just kind of spread it around. Now I have my little card and my borax that we made and I'm just gonna put it in one of these little bags that we got from Michaels. This is just so people know how to make their slime and how to fix their slime if it's too sticky with this little borax. This looks just like the little baggies that I get from my slime packages from Etsy and I think it looks so good. I'm really, really proud of this. So I'm just gonna place this in my little box and then we've got the glue. This is like, you need this to make your slime, guys. Then we've got my foam beads to make the slime super crunchy. Then we 
we've got a slime container. I got this one off of Amazon. This is just what they put their slime in when they're done making it. This is looking really good. And then we're gonna place some little extras on top. So I got these squishies from Michaels. They were surprisingly really expensive. And then we've got this glitter. I got this at the dollar section at Target just to make it extra cool. So I don't wanna add any food coloring to this box because I think it'll look pretty to have a white slime with blue, white, and red stuff inside like bees and glitter and then a little candy cane to go on top to make it extra cute and some more red stuffing and there you go that is your crunchy slime kit the last step is to put on a little bow oh my gosh now when you open it up on christmas it'll be like oh and you're just gonna love it and you'll see glue and it's gonna be awesome i think this is such a good christmas idea and especially like the little beads and the borax and everything that you can DIY. So now we're gonna be making the butter slime kit. Well, for the butter slime, I really wanted to have these little containers. These are like the paint things that you get from kits. And I really wanted to put some food coloring in them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna twist one of the colors off because it's like plastic, so it will twist off. Oh. That was easy. And now I'm gonna wash this out and put food coloring in it so when my friend or whoever I'm giving this to can open it up and it'll be like a little food coloring. And it's gonna be so adorable. Since my containers are all cleaned out, I'm gonna add some food coloring into my containers so they can color their slime. So I decided to just do a red for the butter slime. And now there's some red food coloring inside of here. I'm assembling the butter slime kit. So I'm gonna put in some green stuffing. Then we've got the glue. We've got my little card that says how to make your slime and some borax. And then this is the model magic to make your slime buttery. So we just got this from Michaels and it comes with a bunch of little pouches of white clay. And so we decided to, I decided to use three little pouches of clay because that'll make it extra, extra buttery. So I'm just gonna place that in there. Then we've got our little lotion because butter slime is not good without lotion. And then we've got my little pocket of food coloring. I think it looks so good. Then some glitter, some squishies to play with, and a candy cane on top. And that is my butter slime kit. I think this one's really cute too. I like this box the best out of all of them we bought. And these boxes, by the way, were like $3. Last step, add a little bow on top. This is the fluffy slime box. So it's the same as the butter slime, except instead of Model Magic, I just used shaving cream to make it fluffy. And then this little squishy. This is actually my favorite one because the Santa Claus hat is just really cool. These are my slime kits. I'm really proud of them. These are gonna be great Christmas presents and they're gonna look so adorable under my tree as well. I really hope you guys get some inspiration and you do something like this. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!